Alabama's bats finally woke up, but the tide was outslugged by Louisiana Tech in a 10-8 loss Sunday in the Ruston, Louisiana regional of the NCAA baseball tournament. The defeat ends Alabama's season, which included the program's first trip to the NCAA regionals since 2014 but fell three wins short of the Super Regionals. Louisiana Tech scored nine runs in the first four innings and hit four home runs, outpacing the Tide's three home runs in its most productive offensive outing of the weekend. Tough finish to a tough weekend, coach Brad Bohannon said. We just couldn't do enough offensively. We got some big hits but we didn't string together enough big hits. Alabama, the no. Three seed in the four-team bracket, allowed a combined nine home runs and 18 runs in its two games against no. One seed Louisiana Tech and no. Two seed NC State. The top two seeds will meet Sunday evening, with NC State needing a win either Sunday or Monday to advance to the next round. Alabama took a 2-1 lead in the first inning after a two-run home run by catcher Sam Prater but fell behind on a two-run shot by Louisiana Tech in the top of the second inning. Jackson Tate responded with a solo shot in the bottom of the inning to tie it, but the hosts opened a three-run lead on a three-run homer in the third inning. The Tide continued to fight with a two-run homer by Zane Denton in the bottom of the third only to have Louisiana Tech pull away with its own two-run shot the next inning. When Alabama drove a runner home in the bottom of the sixth, Louisiana Tech shut the door with its fourth and final homer in the seventh. Bohannon's bats faltered as the game progressed, with a combined three runners left on base in the fifth and sixth innings before no runners reached in the seventh and eighth. Alabama threatened in the bottom of the ninth inning, putting four runners on base and scoring twice, before falling short in its comeback bid. Really proud of the fight that we showed late, Bohannon said. Alabama pitcher Jacob McNary, making only his third start of the season, lasted two-plus innings while allowing six runs on six hits. Landon Green gave up another three runs in two innings out of the bullpen before Chase Lee and William Freeman settled down the game with one run allowed in a combined five innings pitched. The Tide finished with a 32-26 record in its fourth season under coach Brad Bohannon. It has not advanced to the Super Regionals since 2010. I feel like, generally speaking, and they're not perfect, this group gave us everything they had, Bohannon said. I'm certainly hopeful that all the kids that are back next year can bring those intangibles back into the locker room next year and we can continue to move our program forward. After the loss, Athletics Director Greg Byrne tweeted he is proud of the progress the baseball team has shown and that Bohannon and his staff are working their tail off to keep us moving forward. Hashtag bright future.